critical time right now on the planet in terms of shark and ray conservation. Here in Indonesia, at least 40% of the species are threatened with extinction. If we don't do something now, they're going to disappear forever. Fortunately, we have this cadre of young Indonesian scientists who are very excited to go out and start shark conservation projects. My name is Rafid Chitki. I'm the project leader of the Treasure Shark Project Indonesia. When you want to achieve the conservation objectives, you have to really understand the situations of the community themselves. The communities are actually willing to be engaged and also to participate in the process of this conservation work that we are doing. Indonesia has been the world's largest shark and ray fishery for over 30 years. Dealing with that, of course, is, is a lot of effort, but we've really seen in the last five to ten years a dramatic change here in Indonesia, and we've done that by focusing specifically on individual villages where you can really get traction. So as an example in Raja Ampat, where they were able to see just how important these sharks and rays are to their tourism industry. We were able to get them to actually make an entire shark sanctuary across Raja Ampat, stop all shark fishing because of that value.